count to ten. I mean, count to twenty. I mean, Mihai. There is no greater joy than seeing bright little faces excited to learn and conquer new things. For Teacher Hung Dang, who is teaching the first Vietnamese dual immersion class in the state of California at DeMille Elementary, this is particularly true when she sees her students connecting the dots with English and Vietnamese. Mình đã dạy trong học khu Westminster cũng 10 năm rồi. I've been teaching in the Westminster area for over 10 years. When I heard about this program, I applied to be the teacher for it. When I was accepted, I went to training on how to teach the students both with local and national language institutions. I also work with Mrs. Pelton, who teaches the English version, to come up with the lesson plans. Now we confer every day and go over what happened during class to trade notes and to see progress. In Westminster, there's a very large Vietnamese community, and there's a strong desire to preserve the heritage language. There are also um, a number of students in the program that have uh, a Latino background and other backgrounds, and they're learning the language as well. So the goal is for the children to be bilingual and, in some cases, trilingual. For some parents, this class could not have come any sooner. When I heard about the program opening up, I was really excited and I wanted in. This way, my daughter will learn about her Vietnamese roots. I can't speak English that well, so I want her to learn Vietnamese. Vietnamese children need to retain their language because, as the saying goes, if we keep our language, we keep our heritage. I read about this program in the newspaper and signed my grandson up. I live in Santa Ana, so it's a little far, but it's worth the drive. He comes home and talks about how much he loves the classes every day. I think it's really beneficial for kids to be bilingual. In total, there are 42 children enrolled in the program and half spend the mornings learning Vietnamese while the other half learn English. Later in the afternoon, they switch. Uh, we like it that she's learning, well she already knows Spanish and English, so now she's learning uh, another one, so that's three, so that's very good. We have certain goals and milestones they need to reach, how to recognize letters, learn their colors, count to 30. It's great to see them be able to count in Vietnamese, especially those who aren't of Vietnamese origin. We split it up, and so far they can count to 10. We still have nine months left, so I am optimistic they will make a whole lot of progress. Kindergartners uh, are, are sponges, as it is, and so uh, they're absorbing things so quickly we couldn't be happier. Tui Fan, Vivek Daily News.